What's up everybody, how you guys doing? Well, I want to let you guys know that I'm doing two movie reviews back to back. So, the first one is Jobs. It has Ashton Kircher in it, and he's starring as Steve Jobs. The maker of Apple, the maker of iPods, iPads, iPhones, Macs, uh, Apple TV. Anyways, Steve Jobs started uh, the Apple industry where it is today. He started from a garage. He started, um, he wanted to be, he saw a dream to be successful. So basically, he was successful. And honestly, I gotta say, Ashton Kircher took it to a whole new level playing Steve Jobs. You know, he had the whole hump going on, you know, in the movie and stuff like that. And it was really interesting the way he uh, pulled off being Steve Jobs and stuff. And um, he showed his career highlights and, um, you know, the kind of asshole that Steve Jobs was. You know, everybody, you know, everybody knows that Steve Jobs was an asshole because he wanted to be the very best. He wanted the very best. He saw a dream. He had a dream. You know, he did a good job making Apple what it was today. So, basically, I give this movie five stars where it's at today. And it's awesome. I recommend you go and see it. So, okay. Movie number two to review. Kick-Ass 2. So, it starts off with McLovin. He was, uh, he changed his name from Red Mist to the Motherfucker. So, the motherfucker, as McLovin, and um, he was uh, getting some gangs together, and he was wanting to, um, he wanted to get revenge on Kick-Ass, since Kick-Ass took out his father, and uh, with a bazooka, so that's what he does. And so, Mindy, aka Hit Girl, was uh, basically, you know, trying to figure out, play the normal life, and, you know, she made promises to certain people that she wouldn't be Hit Girl anymore. Basically, uh, he gets in the gang with Jim Carrey, as Jim Carrey is the general in this movie, and so it's basically really good. So, basically, um, Jim Carrey bitched about, you know, this movie being too violent, and he bitched about, you know, that he wouldn't promote it since it was too violent. So, what I have to say with uh, Jim Carrey uh, promoting that, saying it's too violent, that he's not going to promote it, Jim Carrey should be taking the money back that he got from that movie and giving it back to the movie industry where they paid him. So when Jim Carrey went through the script and read the script and stuff, he didn't think it was too violent then, but then again when he shot it and after the movie was over and they paid his paycheck, he thought it was too violent so he went and bashed kick-ass in the media. So with that being said, um, basically uh, Kick-Ass was really good, um, certain people die in it, certain people find out that he's really Kick-Ass, and um, certain people find out that Mindy's really Hit Girl, so I recommend this movie. McLovin played a very good bad guy, so I recommend to you to check that movie out as well. So those are my two movie reviews, thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. So with that being said, peace out!